there's some interesting, very neat things here. Um, what are some of the things you've learned from being um, a store owner? And it, it, it's been a bumpy couple of years with the economy as it is. You know, framing and art are by no means uh, necessities. They are they are luxuries. Um, but you know, art is, touches such a personal spot for folks that uh, that even with the economy as it is, um, I, I find that folks come in and and they they connect with it somehow. Uh, whether it's a, a, a an ornament, a Christmas ornament, whether it's a plate, whether it's uh, something that's useful or something that's just decorative, uh, I think we all have spots that we. Um, you know, that we feel art has a place in our lives. Um, so d what have I learned? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Every day is something new, right? <laughs> Every day is, is something new. Every day is a new challenge. Um, I've, I've really enjoyed getting to know a lot of the, the local artists. Um, Did you think that you were going to be a store owner when you were back in Arkansas? Oh, Lord, Lord no. No. No, this was... No, this, this this is just kind of a natural progression of events. I, led you I to guess, think that I guess you know I enjoyed working at this store uh, when we were mostly custom framing. That was that was my job was to to work out back and put things together. But I I did work out um, with customer service also, and uh, had always you know toyed with the idea of having an art gallery not at this location but as a separate business, and. Um, because I was interested in the arts community and, well, and, and supporting artist local yourself. artists, and I, I'm somewhat well. of an artist myself. But uh, it, it it all did kind of seem to come together when uh, when Stan and Sue uh, Myers told me that they were retiring. It was like, well, you know, maybe maybe this would work. Um, maybe maybe we can can pull together a, a, a group of fairly local artists, and uh, we kind of try and 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 create a community, it's, it's the hope, anyway, uh, of appreciators and, uh, and producers for art. Well, if people want to learn more about Raven's Wish, what's the best way for them to do it? Though, of course, naturally, the best way is just to walk into the store. That, that would be fine, and, and, and we, we hope that that occurs. We, um, we welcome anyone to come in and just take a look around, ask any questions, uh, learn more about the artists that are represented here. Uh, we do have a website, www.ravenswish.com. Uh, if you want to give me a call, at 608-757-2622. I'll answer any questions about uh, artists or custom framing that you might have. Thank you so much, Alicia. Thank you, Jerry.